Popish, popish, popi, usual fatty, usual fatty. You fatty, fatty. Pinche panchito. Panchito. <laughs> What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be installing a throttle body spacer. This is the Vortice by Volant Performance. And there's a product number right there. Today, I'm going to be installing it on my 2007 Chevy Tahoe. So the first thing I'm gonna do is just go ahead and start it and give it a few revs uh, so you guys can hear what it sounds like right now. We'll install the throttle body and uh, we'll start her up again. We'll go from there. Right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and start it, let it warm up. Just let you guys hear the exhaust. few tools that we're going to need is a ratchet with an extension, a 4mm socket and a 10mm socket and um, a flathead screwdriver. Alright so this only takes but a few minutes to install so the first thing we're going to do is just disconnect the battery terminal. Good just like that. Next we're going to take off the engine cover. Loosen up the clamp. We'll also take it right here. Just loosen up the clamp. There's also the, so the, P, the PC valve right there. Let's just disconnect that. So we break. Now we're going to use the 10. Body. Move it off to the side. You do not want to mess around with throttle plate right there. Um, you get different idle. You might leave it with a high idle, even though if it's dirty. Uh, I suggest you just leave it there. There's plenty of smudge. Just switch over to the little four millimeter socket. I remove these studs. Alright, next up the throttle body spacer. Right here it says throttle side. And we'll put the supplied gasket on the front side right here. We're gonna get the four bolts that they sent in along with the washers. So we're gonna put one on each. So we'll get the throttle body, put the gasket, the spacer, throttle side. All right, so just a real quick note right here. These bolts that come with the throttle body spacer are just a bit long. Um, these are not all the way bottomed out, but they're already pretty much all the way in. And there's still a bit of space. Like you can see that the throttle body is still moving. Um, 
So I'm gonna go ahead and just find a few washers just to put on the bolts and then we'll just tighten it. All right, so I got four more washers. I'm gonna put these on, tighten everything back up and it should be fine. All right, so the kit also comes with this little spacer. Uh, since you put a one inch spacer on the throttle body, so it's gonna push the intake pipe just another inch forward. Little stud right here. You're gonna need to move this one forward one inch. So that's what this is for. All right, this is just a little quick tip. Uh, the same four millimeter that you took off the stud, uh, just put the two one in back of each other like that you use the same pen and you can use this one to tighten it up That's it, just put everything back. All right, so there it is. Everything's back installed. The auto body spacer is in there. Battery is connected. So we're gonna go ahead and start the truck and see how she sounds. All right, so there it is. A few of the mods that the truck has. Uh, it has a stage two cam by Texas Speed. It's a 212 to 18. I do have um, a Magnaflow exhaust, just so I can hear the muffler just a little bit more. In my opinion, I love the Magnaflow. It's not too loud. Once you step on it, that's when you really hear it, and it sounds really beautiful. I like the way it sounds, I love it. Uh, but other than that, it has a street tune by Lucky's down in Mission, Texas. And I'll be getting a charge pipe in the next few days. I still don't have any headers on it, so I'm still running the stock manifolds. I am running the catalytic converters. Uh, so once we get some headers, some long tube headers, we'll go ahead and uh, delete all that. 
and we'll retune it. I know it's hard to visualize what these little parts do on its own. It might not do much. You need other supporting mods, hold air intake, headers, and all that, so you can really notice the power difference. Uh, but this came from eBay. It was a $50 part, Volant. I showed you guys the product number. So if you guys have a four bolt throttle body from a GM 07 and up, that's it.